What's up guys, Mason here from True Metal Supply. Today we're gonna mimic the UL2218 impact resistance test by dropping these two inch steel projectiles onto our metal roofing and metal siding panels. These are pretty heavy. I'm gonna weigh them, I'll tell you exactly how much they weigh. Um, two inches in diameter. We're gonna drop them from 25 feet in the air off of this sky lift. Uh, we're gonna test a 29 gauge tough rib panel that is coated with Sherwood Williams Weather XL SMP. And then we are also gonna test a 26 gauge steel board and batten siding panel um, that is coated with SDI's True Steel wood print. Uh, this is gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna see how these materials hold up under the weight of this two inch steel ball. Let's check it out. All right, let's take her up. Got a two inch diameter steel ball and I'm gonna drop from 25 feet onto our 29 gauge tough rip thing. I missed and my phone fell down. Ah, that sucks. Try this again. 25 feet. All right, so we're going up. We're gonna drop a two inch steel, a two inch diameter steel ball from 25 feet in the air onto a 29 gauge tough rib metal roofing panel. I dropped it a second ago. I missed and my phone fell over because my phone's down there recording. I'm just glad that I didn't smash my phone. Here we go. Let's go see the damage. All right, you can see the two impact points here. They for sure left a dent, but the paint is not chipped or cracked. And the underside of the panel is not cracked. There's no cracking. So, yep, we got dents, but the roof uh, withstood the impact. There's not, uh, there's not material failure here, so there's no leak points from these impacts. 
Let's test some more stuff. Okay, we're doing the test again. This time we're doing it on a 26 gauge steel board and batten siding panel. My target is this small. And I'm 99% sure I'm going to hit my camera or my phone. I've got two cameras down there right now. So this would be a great excuse to buy the iPhone 16 here in just a second. All right, let's measure where we're at. Okay, I'm just telling you, there's a reason I make metal roofing and I don't install it, because being up this high, it's not the life for me. All right. Let's rock and roll. Nice. Two direct hits. Let's go, baby. I knew all those little league pitching gears were gonna pay off. Okay, moment of truth. Let's check it out. So I hit both times on this panel. And there's the dents. And that, I'm gonna tell you, that wood grain does a good job of even hiding the dents. Check that out. I mean, you really got it. You got to, you can see it, but it's not nearly as noticeable as it is on the semi-gloss painted. So that's pretty surprising. And as you would expect, the 29 gauge held up. This is 26 gauge and it definitely held up. We do have dents, but there are no cracks. There is no um, material failure. The paint didn't even chip or flake. Just like the test says that it is um, obviously you know the question isn't whether or not the material is going to dent if a giant steel ball uh, starts falling from the sky the question is is it gonna the material gonna fail and the obvious answer today is that uh, no it's not gonna fail we've got um, we've got proof the proofs in the pudding or in the metal uh, so if you want material that's gonna last a lifetime metal roofing and metal siding can literally withstand a uh, giant two inch steel ball falling from the sky. So, thanks for watching.